We asked self-advocates what self-advocacy means to them. This is what they told us. Self-advocacy to me means that you are able to speak up for yourself and tell people what you want and what you need and get the right supports that you need and be able to tell your dreams and make that possible. I'm sure you might be wondering, what is self-advocacy? What does it mean to you? To me, self-advocacy is about speaking up for myself and for others who are unable to speak up for themselves. And that is the key to self-advocacy. Speaking from your heart, speaking from your own opinion, telling people how you really feel, that is the, that is the keystone of what self-advocacy is. Maybe we try to influence other people to do the same thing, because that is why there are tens and thousands of self-advocacy people from school groups all around this country, guests to, together, talking about issues that are important to you. They talk, they talk about how can we close institutions? How can we go out and vote? That is that exactly what self-advocacy really is. Self-advocacy to me is speaking up for yourself and not letting other people speak for you. Um, there's all kinds of different kinds of self-advocacy. At one time, I didn't know what self-advocacy means. I didn't speak up now. Now look at me today. I'm speaking up what's on my mind. Speak up, speak out. I used to sit home. There was no day programs. I used to sit there, waste my time. You know, I went to a night school, and all it had was with people who had special needs and who were special that they consider us. I saw people go down these steps at one time, go down these steps. They were speaking up for themselves and speaking up for their rights. That was a born of a self advocacy who didn't know what they were. Me, the person who never talked much, didn't have much to say, thought, wow, these people are speaking up with no important issues. So I told my teacher in night school that I wanted to go back to regular school where I was happy to go back, where I learned how to speak up for my rights, and I joined the self advocacy group. Didn't join long, got out of it. Then I went on to a workshop, Meaningful Day Waste Program, for 10 years. Got kicked out. No faults of my own, but that's a story and a half. Got there, went home, got a postcard from a self advocacy group, and I joined it. These people taught me how to challenge myself. Anything they said, I listened to. They taught me how the important issue, that people should have meaningful relationship, one thing, that you can date anybody you want, what a dismay or without. They can have a meaningful job. Who wants to be in the day waste program? They make pennies a day. Well, now you can make whatever minimum wages, you know. Have friends and pick your friends. Pick the things you want. self advocacy means to me is how I spoke up, spoke out, and spoke for other people who couldn't speak for themselves. 